Oh, hi, my name's Jessie Byrne, and I've just been newly appointed as the chair of the Community Advisory Board for SA Power Networks. Um, that board has a really important role in making sure that SA Power Networks makes decisions on the basis of consumer views and on the basis of consumer interests. What we really want to hear is their experiences. So the first thing is, how, how have things gone with you with your electricity? How have things gone with you with your power? What do you think? Uh, do you have any particular concerns that you want to raise and um, think that you can take to SA Power Networks or us? Uh, and the other thing is, you know, energy and electricity in an exciting time. What do you think about the future of energy? Maybe renewables, um, maybe a, a greener approach to creating electricity for your house. So they're the sorts of things I'd like to hear consumers raise. Power is an essential service. What that means is that it's something everyone needs. And for that reason, it's highly regulated by government as it should be to make sure no one's disadvantaged. So why is it essential service? Well, you don't have lights, you don't have heating, you don't have your TV or your phones if you don't have your electricity. So that makes it something we all need to leave good lives and actually to create businesses and to create employment. The Community Advisory Board actually has two main roles. Um, and one is to make sure that ongoing issues around energy, electricity supply are heard by SA Power Networks. That can be anything from renewables to, you know, a whole range of things like how does your poles, how do your poles look? How do your wires look? What's the future of power going to look like for SA Power Networks? What can it invest in? What sort of revenue it can have? And it's very important that consumers actually have a voice in that and in fact, the government expects that SA Power Networks will listen to consumers when it makes decisions about investment, the future of energy, how it will, how it will cope with uh, renewables, what it will do with the infrastructure. I'm really uh, passionate about this role because I actually believe that consumers' voices should be heard, especially when it comes to essential services, in other words, the services we all need. I also really believe that better decisions are made when consumers are engaged. Um, on top of that, I do have a particular commitment to seeing um, the disadvantaged, not disadvantaged. You know, equitable outcomes are really important to me. And it strikes me that if an essential service is not delivered equitably, then there are people who fall increasingly behind in our community. So that's why I'm passionate about this role.